case management can be used in a variety of ways and can be tailored for your school. In this example, we will set up a case for a student changing majors and needs to meet with a counselor. We start by clicking the Students tab. Locate your student and click the student's name. On the left, under Student Home, click Cases. On the lower right, click the plus symbol. Enter the necessary information to start a case. Fields marked in Lemon Chiffon are required fields. Give your case a name. If a name is not provided, the system will auto-generate a name. The drop-down menus contain options entered in the case management setup phase. If additional options are required, see the videos or documentation on setting up case management. Give a detailed description of the student's case. Use the notes area to provide additional information about the case or the student. Clicking Save creates your case. Additional data entry areas are displayed below after case creation. The Issues area of case management is used for documenting issues related to a case. Click the down arrow next to Issues. On the lower right, click the plus symbol. The current date is automatically populated but can be adjusted. You can set a follow-up date. Checking the box will display this event on the student's calendar. After selecting an issue, enter a detailed description explaining the issue affecting the case. Then click OK. The Actions area of Case Management is used for documenting actions related to the student's case. Next to Actions, click the down arrow. On the lower right, click the plus symbol. Fields marked in Lemon Chiffon are required fields. You may set a follow-up date and a due date. Checking the box next to each will allow the event to display on the student's calendar. After selecting an action, enter a communication type, duration, and a detailed description explaining the action step. Then click OK. The Resources area of Case Management is used for supplemental resources associated to the case or used for linking an external reference resource. Click the down arrow next to Resources. To the lower right, click the plus symbol. You may set a follow-up date. Checking the box will display this event on the student's calendar. From your drop-down menu, Select a resource. Give a detailed description of this resource. Then click OK. In this area, we record organizations and entities requesting case information or transcripts. Click the down arrow next to Send To. To the lower right, click the plus symbol. Select an action associated with the requests, then fill in the form with the information of the person or entity submitting the request. Then click OK. 
The documents area of a student's case is linked to the forms and documents area of Maestro. Any form or document related to the student's case can be attached here. Click the down arrow next to Documents. Under Forms, click the box next to the form needed. In the center, click the arrow icon to add the form to the area on the right. Under Documents, click the box next to the document needed. In the center, click the arrow icon to add the document to the area on the right. Then click Save. The handler's area of case management is where personnel are assigned to a case. Start by clicking the down arrow next to Handlers. Click the box next to one or more names from the list on the left. To add the selected case handlers, click the arrow icon located in the center. To add a group or team of handlers, click the box next to the teams or group name. To add the selected case handlers, click the arrow icon located in the center. Then click Save. Start by clicking the Students tab. On the left, click Cases. As in much of Maestro 5, you can search using the column header area. Searching by status displays all the cases with a selected parameter. Likewise, selecting a case type will display cases associated with that type. Searching made easy, just enter the corresponding search criteria in any of the column headers. Once you've found your case, click the edit column of that row to edit or view the details of the case.